Hi angels, welcome back to my channel. Today we are tuning in from my bedroom with my fresh wallpaper. Guys, what's my favorite type of PR to receive? Huda Beauty PR. Ah! Okay, I am literally so excited to try these. So you guys might have seen that Huda reformulated her classic liquid matte lipsticks and I this formula, even the older formula, I was happy with. So how could it get any better? Let's read the claims so we can know what has actually changed. Um, so one swipe application of vibrant color. Thinnest possible formula dries down with zero stickiness. Um, it's a suede matte finish available in 16 versatile shades. Cruelty free. Very nice. Okay, but... It says, I read somewhere that it was transfer proof. Where does it say that? Oh, it says it right here. Transfer proof, ultra comfortable, eight hour wear. We're gonna put her to the test immediately. Okay, I don't know where to start. Okay, let's actually start. I see my favorite one. So my OG favorite was Bombshell. I used to wear Bombshell every single day of my life. Like in the summer that this came out, I was like, Bombshell, Bombshell, Bombshell. Anyone, anytime someone was like, what's your... What's on your lips? I'm like, oh, just bombshell. There was no need to even ask. It was assumed at that point. <laughs> so we're going to start with this one. Um, also, guys, I think it's going to be really helpful to see it on my skin tone. I decided, by the way, to film today in my bedroom because the lighting was just popping. And I thought, let's just do it here with the natural light. Nothing's better. Okay, so I'm starting off with the Huda Beauty Terracotta Lip Liner. This is the one that I tried to sharpen and I butchered it by accident. Let's not talk about that. If you know, you know. Okay, so here we go. All I have to say is just don't sharpen this, okay? It's a twist. It's a twist. There's no need to try and butcher this with your sharpener like I did, okay? Anyway, like I said, moving right along. It's clear that I can't, it's clear that it still triggers me to this day. <laughs> so we're just, we're just moving right along. Okay, wait, where's the, hello? Where's Bombshell? Oh, there she is. Okay, the moment of truth. Okay, I'm so excited. I just physically, does it, oh, it still smells the way it used to smell, which was one of my favorite things. Oh, wow, that just brought me back to a time just smelling it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't worry, I'm gonna come closer in a moment so you guys can really. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Okay, so it's the formula feel, feels really soft initially on the lips. This is how it's looking. Let me know what you guys think. I think it looks really nice with the blush that I chose. What's going, guys, by the way, do I have bangs? <laughs> do I have bangs now? Did, why didn't anyone let me know? I just didn't get the memo that I'm banged. Anyway. I'm here for this color, but I just want it to dry so we can actually test if it's smudge proof, if it's kiss proof. Okay, let's have some water and then we'll figure out. Gulps loudly. Okay, I see a little, little tiny bit of it on my glass. That's possibly because I didn't let it dry. Should we, should we wait a moment? Are we waiting just a quick moment? What's our vibe? When you're ready, come and get it. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, so for the most part, it's pretty clean. Oh, wait, you guys can't see. It's pretty clean. It had a little bit. I think it might be because I'm not letting it um, sit and I'm not letting it dry because I am impatient and I want to see the other colors. Okay, so again, guys, this is Bombshell. I really like it. I think it's really pretty. Oh, in the sun, in normal lighting, though, I think it's really pretty. Okay, next. Going in with the shade Perfectionist. Same lip liner. I've never used this shade before. It is very pretty. I think this one looks even better with my blush right now that I have on. I tried to do a neutral eye look so that I could kind of pull off any lip color. Ooh. My lips are popping. 
but I will say that this new formula is very lightweight. Like it doesn't feel heavy on the lips. You know, those really drying formulas of liquid lipsticks. I hate that. This You're not seeing that here. I think it's so pretty. I'm coming in closer. Oh, the sun is kind of ruining it. I love, I love it. Like I'm going to be wearing this every day. Just be ready. Just be ready that this is replacing, this almost might replace bombshell for me, but if I'm wearing this kind of pinky blush, I will be wearing this, this, this shade icon, which I have a feeling might be iconic. Side note, my lips are in Spain without the S. Okay. Check this out. Same lip liner. Ooh, this is so pretty. I already am thinking of the perfect blush that would pair really nicely with this shade. I think I want to film a video of like lip lip shades that go well with specific blush shades because I feel like that's what makes you kind of capable of pulling off certain lip colors. Okay, I almost choked on my own spit there. Nice. Now that I'm trying it on like 50 times, I'm realizing how nice the formula actually feels on my lips. Guys, if I'm not putting it on perfectly, like, you know, with my usual perfectionist inside is like, what are you doing, Anthea? You're applying it in your bedroom without your lighting and blah, blah, blah. But I just wanted to show you guys what it would look like also true, like wearing it on a daily in natural light. Cause guess what? You don't have studio lights walking around. So here's the shade. All righty, next up we have Trophy Wife. And yes, I still have this bang right here. Is it here to stay? Again, the answer is yes. How long will it be here? Nobody knows, okay? We're just going with the flow. Okay. I am a fan of purple lips. My favorite color is purple. This isn't like a bright purple or anything like that. It's a wearable one. Okay, let me just stop talking before I mess this up. <laughs> I don't know why there's Christmas music in my head, like Christmas, and Thea, Christmas is over. Here it is. I think it's really pretty. Oh, it's on my teeth, honestly, you know what I just realized? I don't think it's physically possible for me to film one full YouTube video without getting lipstick on my teeth at some point. So I think it's just like, it's a wing it tradition that it had to happen at some point or the other. I'm let, I'm trying to let it dry, but I think this looks really pretty. In terms of the formula, again, I just want to talk about the fact that it's really soft on the lips. It's true, it's not sticky. There is still lipstick on my teeth. Oh yeah, Kool-Aid. Imagine the Kool-Aid man just like burst into the door. That would be a dream of mine. Anyway, I don't know why that just came up, but I mean, it wouldn't be a dream because that would be kind of scary. Like where would he come from? What, like there's many other questions that go along with that. Anyway, okay, let's move on to the next. A red lip liner just to make sure that this red goes on smooth. This is called Real Red by Buxom. I'm just gonna quickly line it. I'm not going to line it thick because I don't really want to change the color of the liquid lip. Of course, I would be screwing up the shape right away. <laughs> Do not recommend talking while doing this. That's for sure. Okay, so this shade is called Miss America. I am... As soon as I saw it, I was dying to try it. And I saw it on Huda actually online, like on like like on her IG. Oh my goodness. I fell in love with it right away, but I'm wondering how it's going to look on my skin tone. We're about to find out. <gasps> oh my goodness. This is so pretty. Oh my goodness. It's not even on yet and I'm already obsessed. Holy, here it is up close. I can't really see. I hope the lighting's okay. Here it is. Um, honestly, 
I'm obsessed with this red. Like I don't wear red that often on my lips, but this is making me want to wear it. I have become fully obsessed. Huda, you did it again. You freaking you freaking did it again. We love you. Honestly, I'm obsessed with the whole collection. That concludes my video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you didn't get a chance to check it out, go ahead and check out my video on my wallpaper right here. You can see it in the background of this video. I did that recently and I kind of did a before and after. So let me know what you guys think on that one. And again, I will see you guys next time. Please don't forget to like and subscribe.